So this video is about how I told my family I was pregnant and of course my husband's family but okay so I told his family first because they were I, I guess you could say easier to tell but just because uh, all his siblings pretty much have kids already and um, they all have had them at a pretty young age so it wouldn't have been much of a shock to his family so um we told his family first and his mom already knew his aunt already knew his brother already knew his two sisters i guess were kind of disappointed and um one of his sisters just slapped him so she wasn't mad she was like i don't know she probably was mad inside but she did in a joking way and um she so, I don't know, she just, she just, um, she was kind of upset, you know, um, because at the time, I guess they weren't too fond of me, oh well, um, so the first person I told was my stepmom, I think, I think, or like, my cousin had found out, like, just found out somehow she found out but um first point I told with my stepmom and um she was pretty shocked and I told I was really scared to tell my dad because you know, he's pretty strict and um thought he was gonna beat up my boyfriend and <laughs> thought he was gonna be pretty upset and turns out he wasn't upset but he was actually happy he was excited or whatever his like biggest fear throughout his whole life was becoming a grandpa because he still thinks he's all young and cool and hip or whatever so um he just didn't want to become a grandpa so that's the first thing he said when i sent him the picture all i did was send him the picture of the ultrasound like i didn't say anything or anything like that that's why i waited till i was like three months to tell my family so <laughs> I sorry, got a text message. So I um I got um I just sent them pictures of ultrasound. I got an ultrasound, I waited till then so it would be easier to just tell them and I could just, you know, show them the picture and I, I wouldn't have to explain it and have this awkward can I tell you something? You know, I just I didn't want that. So then um I sent him the picture and he said you made me a grandpa and so you know that's all he was really worried about you know he wasn't he wasn't even mad he was, he was pretty excited it was, of course it's an awkward thing because no dad really wants to know that their daughter's having sex you know so of course it was awkward you know it took him a while to get used to it and even now when, that I do have my baby like he's still kind of you know edgy about it or whatever you know you know he thinks he's the most handsome little boy ever um so it was scary to tell him and my mom we actually weren't on good terms i didn't want to tell her because you know i just kind of thought like oh why should i tell her or whatever and um but his family actually told me to tell her and But, um, so, I, yeah, I told my mom, I just sent her the picture, and that was just because his family told me to, told me that I should, and, you know, I regret it, or something like that, and if she doesn't respond, then that's on her. We get along now, but back then we didn't, so, I told her and of course it wasn't that hard and um so then i told my aunt b and i i figured she'd be pretty disappointed and she kind of was she was just like whatever about it and um she she just said she wished you there i would have waited but you know it's a blessing to have a kid so she she wasn't mad but um 
then she told me that she wanted to tell people and if it was okay and I told her you know it just make my life a lot easier so I didn't care so she told people for the most part and especially my aunt Coco who she's really close with and I was really scared to tell her but because it's just like a respect thing you know she I was really scared to tell her but also she wasn't mad either you know she I guess she kind of saw it as a blessing too and so the rest of the people found out just because I, I put I posted it on Facebook I just posted all just on Facebook just so people could find out on their own and um you know friend of a friend tells friends and friends and you know everybody found out by then so then um yeah my advice to people who are pregnant and they're teenagers and they're scared to tell people honestly I would just tell people whenever you're ready really just whenever you're ready because it's you know people always tell you it's better to tell people earlier and honestly that's not true because it doesn't really matter my reason for not telling people early was just because um miscarriages do happen and i didn't want it like to disappoint somebody and then be like oh i have a baby and then there's no baby you know sadly that's how it happens for some people but um I thank God everything was okay and I just I would just start with one person that you trust and then maybe they can help you to tell everybody else and um, or just even be there with you you know it makes it a lot easier and don't expect you know if you're scared to tell your parents don't expect you know for them to not be disappointed don't expect for them to not be mad don't expect for them to not lecture you i'm not saying it's gonna be that easy i'm just saying that it's not going to last very long they will be upset with you just for a small period of time you know but they're gonna get over it they have to get over it you're their child they love you unconditionally just just know that you know them you never know they might be excited even though like i tell i'm telling you i thought my dad was going to be so furious and he wasn't and it's just when you least expect it you know like somebody could you think somebody is going to be very very upset with you but they're okay you know they, they're happy for this blessing like i'm telling you they all this whole you know disappointment thing it gets pushed out the way because they know the blessing so i would just tell people you know whenever you feel like you're ready don't wait too long because you don't want to tell them and then all of a sudden you have a baby coming you know and well, that's just my advice to teen moms out there i know it's not very very good advice i guess but it's what i could tell you from my experience